Yo, what is up, guys? So for today, we're gonna be talking about Destiny 2. Now, specifically, we're gonna be doing the Hunter for this season, season of the Splicer, and he has got to be probably one of my favorite ones so far. Mostly because I was trying to go for like a cowboy look. To be quite honest, I still don't know if I like the arms or not, but I think they look the best out of like everything I've tried. So let's get right into it. Let me show you guys what I'm wearing so, so right now. So the helmet is an actual white helmet, which is really cool. I think that's probably one of the better ones. If I had to choose, maybe this one would have been a, a good one as well, or this one. But I think the one that I chose is just a little bit better. It it gives me cowboy vibes. And obviously, if you guys don't know, I was going for like a cowboy like look. It, it's really hard. I still don't think I nailed it but I did my best with it. Uh, the arms are pretty dope. I do like the arms. I mean, obviously I got it. Uh, I was going for like a non-armored look again for my Hunter. I've done this before, but this one is a little bit better in my opinion, just because uh, there's almost like no armor on this. I think like there's like one piece on the helmet and then one piece on the legs and I, that's it. So I, I love it. This was going to be the other arm that I was going to use, but I didn't like the fact that this looked like a, not metal, more like a, like a really hard plastic. So I was like, I don't want to wear that. Like I want to wear something that, that doesn't look like I have armor because if you guys know this shader has like chrome in it for the armor pieces, as you guys can see down here. So the fact that there's almost no chrome in this makes me really happy because again, I was tr trying to go for a no, no armored look. I ended up using this chest piece, which again, it's really cool. And it's really weird. Cause like for me, I think I nailed the cowboy look, but at the same time, like I could do better. Cause like the arms, I could probably do better with some other thing. It's just the fact that like the cowboy look, like Drifter has a few cowboy looks, but unfortunately I don't like them. Like this is cowboy, but at the same time, not. Uh, the OG uh, drifter armor like it looks bad in my opinion at least the arms maybe if I did like another piece that would have been cool but at the same time like the other unfortunate thing is the fact that uh, the drifter armor is non shaderable at some areas so like for example if I can find this yeah, it's right there I saw it so this one the shader will not change color for the yellow and white so I thought about wearing it, but the fact that it's also on the front, I was like, I'm I'm not going to do that. Fuck that. So, yeah, let me know your thoughts in the comments below. I'm going to go through my weapons as well just to show you guys what I've been using th during this season. But I'm using the Lucky Pants just because, again, I'm trying to go for that cowboy look. I was trying to look go for a Cade 6 look because uh, Lucky Pants, that's just something I think he would wear. But it's really hard to do it. Um, if you guys want me, I can show you guys in a, in a separate video. Uh, I have been thinking about making more transmog content, but uh, I don't know. It's such a weird thing. Last but not least for the cloak, I ended up wearing this one because I just feel like it was the best out of all of them. Not only that, I didn't want to have a cloak that didn't have a good like under part for it because uh, I didn't want it to like look like this, even though I wasn't going to have this because I again, I vetoed it. But like this one, it's kind of like floating on it. So I didn't want to have something like that. And this one was like the best one that I can find. I was tempted to do this one. Uh, and I still do like it. I just think uh, like for a cowboy, I think he having a cloak is just a little bit better. So as for weapons, I'm currently using the steady hand just because uh, why not? I'm a meta. I'm a meta slave. But jokes aside i do tend to use more like this right here this would be something i would use a lot which is like oh you're using the meta but you're also using like a shitty shotgun which like i love this shotgun so it's pretty funny to me um but yeah like reese walker i love it i've already made a video on it astro horizon i still have this it's still good uh dead man's tell i hope it gets nerfed soon hawk moon doesn't need a nerf it's pretty good City Hand already said about this. Uh, multi multi Mac. I wish I got the Killing Wind and Kill Clip, but I mean, I'll take what I fucking can get at this point. Succession, which is Reconstruction and Recombination. Uh, I wish I got Vorpal Weapon instead, but I mean, it's still a good roll in my opinion. Ignition Code, I have Lead from Gold and Vorpal Weapon, which is super fucking, fucking cool. 
and Chroma Rush, which has Heating Up and Rampage. I have another one that has a, what is it? Um, subsistence, no, not Subsistence? Subsistence. I, I think it's Subsistence. The one that you get more ammo once uh, when you kill stuff. Well, I have that and Rampage, so I don't know why I have Heating Up on, my, on this one. For our secondaries, I have Bottom Dollar, I have a Rangefinder and Rampage one, which is pretty fun. I have Xeno Class uh, for the 1-2 Punch build that I like to do. Uh, Salvager Salvo, which with ha that has Ambitious Assassin and Chain Reaction, which is super fire. Seventh Seraph, I have a Quick Draw and Snapshot Sights. Thank God I got another roll of this. Uh, Palindrome, Killing Wind and Rampage. I will not be getting the Adept because I just don't find the point. And Ikelos for the 4th Times of Charm and High Impact Reserves. This is mostly for single player use. And then last but not least, I have heavies that you probably don't care about because let's be real, fuck heavies. But yeah, that's pretty much it. Let me know your thoughts in the comments below. I have I, <clears throat> I have other builds that I do like to do most of the time. Uh, I'll probably go through a video of like my top five most favorite Hunter and Warlock and Titan builds. I still haven't completed my Titan one, so that one's going to be a while. But eh, actually... No, my Warlock is done as well, but my Titan is not. My Titan, I'm actually struggling quite a bit with her. With her. Um, but once I'm done with her, I'll most likely have it posted up. So, yeah, be safe, guys. Now what's happening in the world, and I'll see you guys later.